strabismus. This is the big one, and this is this happens usually uh, at age three. That's when the child wake up one day and the eye turning in or turning out, or it starts turning in more. Um, and usually the doctors will recommend surgery uh, to straighten the muscles. Now the strabismus is not in the eye. It is how the brain controls the movement of the eye. And the brain is perfectly capable of doing that. If you cover the good eye, then what happens to that eye? It starts engaging. So the brain can control it. Now the, the key is, when we can do this with vision training, is to begin to teach the brain to use both eyes at the same time. So they begin to track, and then eventually the brain will use both eyes, and you have perfect vision. This is, vision training has 90% success with this. It's the 1940s. Surgery is sometimes necessary, but it should be the last option. Uh, also, with vision training, you get perfect. You get perfect 3D. You're not just the eyes are looking straight. That's what the uh, surgery promises you. Getting the uh, 3D the vision with surgery is like winning in the lottery. It is not very often that it happens. Usually, the eyes are just looking straight. That's what the doctor promises you. But you might not be actually be using both eyes. So, with vision training. Uh, often it is something that goes fairly quickly. Sometimes, of course, it takes longer time, depending on the case, depending on many different factors. But if you have a child with strabismus, try the vision training first before you use the knife. If you use the knife, then vision training should follow. Right? Because you need to train, you need to do physical therapy for the eyes. You've done the surgery to get the eye more or less straight, but now you need to get the brain to get involved, and surgery does not involve the brain. Success is uh, patience and lots of exercise. Do it very often, and then uh, you will see great results. It's absolutely wonderful when you see the children coming back, sometimes after years, uh, and they have perfect eyes, straight, perfect 3D vision. It's a miracle. Strabismus is when one eye turns in, that's called esotropia, or if it turns out, it's called exotropia. The turning in is more popular than the other one, so most children will children will sort of develop this around age three. We don't really know the reason why. It could be many, many things, but we don't really know the reason why it does that. We do know that it's trainable. Let's go from this to this. Vision training has 80% success rate, no surgery, no patches. Strabismus is in the brain. It's how the brain controls the eyes, how it controls the muscles, or, or how the brain controls the direction of the eye. And if the eye is controlled, both eyes are controlled at the same time, you get 3D vision and your eyes will function normally. Surgery will only guarantee that it looks cosmetically, whereas the eyes are straight, but there's no guarantee that you use both eyes.